Hello everybody, I just want to do a little wee bit of a rant video, it's something that's really been annoying me over the last good few months, is I know a lot of us is, are having to rely on online shopping and get, you know, our groceries and that delivered as, you know, it's harder to go to supermarkets and, you know, with the current situation. I am actually gluten free and dairy intolerant due to gastro problems with that one of our supermarket chains major supermarket chains or you know your grocery shopping and that um i'll say you know um it's a new zealand um, brand countdown when you go onto their app or onto online to do your shopping you used to be able to put in um gluten-free and it would come up with every single option that's gluten-free and you know that kind of thing so you'd have your bread your pastas your bakery items that are dairy you know gluten-free and the same would happen with your dairy-free you'd get your dairy-free milk your dairy-free you know dessert things and anything that's dairy-free since that unfortunately a few months ago they changed that you go to put in gluten free and it comes up with comes up with a lot of random things like sauces and fruits and veggies and thing and then it will throw in chips that have got gluten in it or you know random things you might get the odd gluten free bread um and the same thing happens with dairy free you got to put dairy free in and it just comes up with random things it doesn't come up saying you know uh say this milk dairy-free milk and that kind of thing so it's really frustrating because what you actually have to do is you've got to first of all know what product they've got in and and search that item like you'd say for example gluten-free bread and it would come up with the gluten-free breads or gluten-free pasta and come up with the gluten-free pastas and that's absolutely fine because you know that the supermarket's going to have that sort of thing you know, they would, um, but you've got to go in and put gluten-free bakery if you want the bakery items. You've got to add something to it. So you might, because with this company, a lot of these gluten-free products are only available online. They don't have it in your local store. They might have it in a large store, but I don't live close to a large store. So, you know, there's like, say, this app, I think it's called Apro um, Dairy Free. It's like a yogurt dessert kind of thing. You'd have to put that down. So you'd kind of have to know what they've got on online before you do it, um, which is hard because you're not psychic. And unless they're going to list it, how you know, how you're supposed to know. If it's not in your current supermarket, you know, you don't know what products are out there and what are available. Where so it gets really, really annoying, as I guess you could imagine. One supermarket that is excellent um, that does online shopping as well is New World. New World is brilliant. You go and you put dairy free. You get all the products that are dairy free, gluten free. You get all the products that are gluten free. It's a lovely app, you know. But the only thing with them is they have a small um, delivery van and they only have set times that you can get it delivered. And of course, currently at the moment, Auckland, where I live, is in, under level three. And of course, so a lot of people are getting foods online. Um, and so that's making, you know, you have to kind of, I don't know, you know, <laughs> Buy your sh buy your shop buy your stuff this week and get it next week and have to go to your you know have enough money to go to your go out to your supermarket to start that that kind of week off, which is fair enough. I mean you know there's a lot of you know a lot of people, but you know it would, I just miss those days that you could yeah just do you know do that go onto the app or go on to online shopping and just select the random product that you need and it would you know pop up well not random gluten-free so yeah
come on countdown you know make it easier for us countdown and you know online shoppers and people that are gluten free and dairy intolerant as i know i'm not the only one around you know so yeah so it's just a little bit of a bit of a rant video and thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you guys next time thank you bye